Hello everyone, it is Grace and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video is quite a lot of pressure because we're going to be finding my 18th birthday dress. I turned 18 in less than a week today, which is scary. To be honest with you, I do not want to be 18. I feel like my whole year of 17 has been wasted. I just want to reverse back a year. I don't want to be 18. I've ordered loads of dresses from ASOS because I feel like they're the best place at the minute to find dressy stuff because obviously because of COVID, no one's really celebrating anything. So nowhere selling dresses. None of the brands are selling dressy clothes apart from ASOS, which is delicious. ASOS are actually doing a lot of reductions as well. So if you're looking for an 18th dress or maybe 21st dress or somewhere in between, then maybe go on ASOS because they have a lot of nice going out dresses. So for my birthday, I have quite a few celebrations, but this video is aimed for my brunch because I feel like that's the dressiest occasion. So I have two brunches booked. I have Tonight Josephine and Gauchos. I've got my Gauchos outfit sorted, but I haven't really got the Tonight Josephine one sorted. So I feel like I need to find a pink dramatic dress for tonight Josephine because that's the kind of vibe I want to go for. We're gonna just get into it. I've seen some really cute ones already. I found this pink dress on there which is incredible. It's like Sharpay vibes. It's like a Sharpay dress. It's amazing. It's in this like fuchsia colour and it's got these big puffy sleeves. It ties in at the waist. I love this. The colour is like incredible. Oh my god, it's amazing. The colour is like so 70s, like disco vibes. Oh, love it. The only thing I'm thinking is it's quite not frumpy because I don't think a middle aged mum would wear this. I mean, like, it's quite covered up, and I don't mean to sound like a bit of a slag, but I want to wear something a bit more revealing, even if that be sleeveless, even if that be bodycon. I don't know, it's quite baggy as well. I want like a bodycon element, whereas this is like complete bag. That's the only thing I would say about this. But we're gonna try it on and see how it looks. I feel like this has set the video off with a good start. It's so cute, but we'll try it on and see. Okay, so I've got the first dress on. I'm not sure how to feel about it because I love the sparkles. It just is slightly mum vibes. It can't just be me that's getting mum vibes from this. Another thing I'd say is, if I was going to wear this, it's not very secure. I feel like you'd be dancing, and then everything would just come out. Because there's one tie, and then the, this bit here, there's no button or anything for. Maybe it isn't, Mum. Maybe I'll watch this back and think, oh, it doesn't look that Mum. But when I've looked in the mirror, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just not, like, crazy about it. I would love a dress in this colour and sequin. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. I really liked this. Something I was looking for was a dress with a bow on it. By Collective, the label. And it's this, like, kind of taffeta dress. First thing I'm thinking when I see this is a Christmas present. Like, you would literally look like a Christmas present. It's got two ruffles and then gold bow sleeves. This would be such a cute, like, Christmas party, New Year's party dress. But it's a birthday. Do you know what I mean? We'll see how it looks on. But if this was in pink, or if this was all black, then it could be an option. But I feel like the black and the gold is just too Christmas. Don't get me wrong. I'd be wearing this on Christmas. I'd be prancing around my house in this on Christmas. And I may even have to keep it for Christmas. But for my birthday, do I want to look like a Christmas present? Probably not, but we're gonna see because it could be really cute, guys. <laughs> this dress has got to be, I can't, I actually can't deal with this dress. Like, I literally look like a Christmas cracker. It's ridiculous. This is probably the biggest foul from the haul. I mean, the quality is not great. Um, yeah, I just look like a Christmas cracker. This is the sort of dress I would have worn from like monsoon when I was eight. I mean, a lot of the dresses are, but like, this takes it to another level. I mean, I do look like a Christmas present, like a pageant Christmas look. I can't, I cannot deal. I'm not gonna comment, but I feel like if it was made of like better fabric and not as like unflattering, it could have been cute. Next one is like a jacquard 
baby pink dress. It's like a Bardo Jacquard pink dress. This is so cute. So it's all ruffly. And then it comes down at the bottom and has more Jacquard. My only critique, I know I'm finding things wrong with every dress, but we need to be selective. This is an important event. The only thing I'd say about this is I don't really like the side panelling. I'd rather it just be this print all over. We shall see, I'm not sure. But I do love the colour of it and I love this like gold and pink pattern. I think it's really nice. Okay, so we have the kind of salmon pink coloured dress on. Now that I've seen some of the other dresses, I can't remember if this was one of the first or one of the last. I tried on most of the dresses now and just you wait to see some of the bubblegum ones. Like they're so nice. I don't know if this really is the colour I want to go for, but you know what I was thinking? This would be like the perfect dress to wear to a wedding or like a baptism because it's a really nice shade of pink. I guess it is a little bit revealing if we're going into church. But I think this would be such a nice dress to wear to a wedding. And I think it's such a nice material and I love the dramatic bardo sleeve or whatever it is. Next thing I got was another sparkly dress. I wanted to get some sparkly ones because I feel like when it's your birthday you need to wear like sequins or diamantes of some sort. Like it wouldn't be a birthday if you didn't. And I also feel like tonight Josephine is really like glamorous, extra, it's all pink. So I needed stuff like this like sequins or pink or just like puffy, do you know what I mean? So this one is like a sequin dress. Kind of reminds me of like a 20s flapper girl outfit which I love. I actually think this is going to be really cute. <gasps> no. 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 <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> I'm going to cry. I'm actually going to cry. Guys. It's a cold and I thought it was a dress. And I've not ordered the top. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. I'll just show you this skirt. I can order the top another time. Probably won't be in stock because it's ASOS. <laughs> no. It was meant to be this top and skirt cold. I should have known better because ASOS always sell their cold separately. It's this beaded skirt. I can always order it again uh, with these sequins and diamantes. I'm gonna try and order the top. Should we see if it's in stock? This was a skirt and top cobbled. Let me see if the top's in stock. I'll have a look again later, but it looks like they're just selling the skirt, which is really annoying. All of my next dresses are quite similar, so don't get too bored. I've had this dress already because I did an ASOS order a couple of weeks ago. I really liked this, but I ordered an eight and the eight wouldn't fit. I couldn't get it done up, so if you're gonna get this, definitely size up. It's this like organza, really dramatic. It's so like 80s and tacky, but I love it. It's kind of like taffeta. It's just such a like 80s party prom dress. It's amazing. If I can get it done up, this could definitely be an option. And again, it's by Club L London. And I think it was only like 30 pounds, which is so good. Out of all of these, I feel like this one and the sparkly one so far are my faves. Okay, so we have the pink dramatic dress on i love this this reminds me of like a pageant toddlers and tiaras dress it's a little bit like the dress from jim Bellista. i can't say the name of it who remembers h&m they had that collection with jim benista valley or something like that um, and they did loads of like puffy dresses like this it's just like a cupcake taffeta dress like when i was younger i would have lost my shit over this dress it kind of does remind me slightly of my dress last year as well like the taffeta bottom and the corset well not corset top but like it's kind of tight along the top i think this is probably one of my favorites out of this haul oh you're gonna have to let me know what you think in the comments i feel like some people are gonna absolutely hate this but some are just gonna love it but some are just gonna love it and i love it <laughs> it was only 30 quid as well which i thought was so good club l london again i think this one was let me know your thoughts but I'm obsessed. The next one I got was so cute as well. So it's this kind of like taffeta dress again. What would you call this sort of skirt? I don't know what you'd call this. It's like a bubble hem skirt, which I think is so cute. Again, like it's so 80s. It's like Rachel Green from Friends' bridesmaid dress, which I love. This is just the exact vibe I want to go for for tonight, Josephine. I just want something really like 
puffy and like dramatic and pink. This could be the one. I can't deal with it. Low key feel like a child though. I can't believe it. I cannot get over it. It's like perfect. I absolutely love it. I love the hem. I love the top of it. I love it with the pearl necklace. Like I literally look a Barbie. For her birthday, my friend is doing a Barbie themed dinner. So I don't know where to wear this, get like a blonde wig, blue contacts and wear this for that because this is so Barbie or whether to wear it for my birthday. It's so childish but I don't even care. I literally don't even care. I love it. The last dress of the video is this one. So this is quite similar material to the one I just showed you but it's a different shape. So this is like a v-neck kind of dress. It's from a brand called Bardot. This taffeta material again. It's literally the perfect shade. It's like bubblegum pink. This is probably the nicest quality dress in this video. I did not expect to like this as much as I do. They only had a six left, so I really don't know if this is going to fit me. But we're going to see. I feel like this ends the video on a good note. So we have the last dress on. This one is such nice quality. Like It feels like a designer dress. I can't even explain it to you. It really does feel designer. I do definitely have to wear a pearl necklace with one of my outfits yeah it was far too small for me but it definitely has like a barbie vibe i love all of the details i love this ruffle front i feel like it's really flattering and yeah this would have been a good option for me if it fit but i'm gonna try and see if the eight will come back in stock because ace was always restocking stuff like on the inside it feels like velvet it's such nice quality so i hope you all enjoyed this video give it a big thumbs up if you did hopefully from a few days from now i'll be uploading my birthday prep so like nails tan hair dresses that video will go up next i think and then it'll be just a classic what i got for my birthday and vlog i hope you all enjoyed and let me know in the comments if there's any other birthday videos you'd like me to do when you're watching this i could be 18 which is crazy to me so i'll see you all in my next one bye